So Freddy, uh, it looks pretty hot out there today. Uh, how was it? It was just uh, five and a half hours of suffering. Uh, yeah, I'm really disappointed that I lost the jersey. But uh, again, I'm, I mean, if you look at uh, the way that uh, Vöckler took it from me, you, I can do nothing. I mean, he, uh, he had a superb race and uh, I think it, it must have taken every point that was possible to take today. And uh, yeah, it didn't matter if, whether I was feeling good or not or, uh, you know, the way he did it, just, uh, yeah, chapeau. You seemed to, uh, to keep in touch pretty well during the first part of the race and then you began to feel the pinch a little bit afterwards. I mean, uh, you know, my objective today was those, those first two HC categories. I thought uh, maybe, you know, by the last two Cat 1s that uh, the Pelton would, uh, would catch us. Uh, but uh, in the end, you know, there was quite a big gap. So, yeah, Thomas, uh, he could, uh, could keep on riding and get the, the, the sec those points as well. And uh, I think that's what made him uh, overleap me in the end. And uh, it's been a bit of a tussle for the, for the Polka Jot jersey so far. It's changed hands a few times, hasn't it? Um, how much do you think, um, and we're speculating here, Vokler may have left on the road today? Uh, hopefully he spent a lot of energy today and hopefully I can recover and feel even better tomorrow. But uh, yeah, you know, you never know. Every, everything can happen. Although I think it's, I mean, everybody has spent a lot of energy out there. You know, we all had to, to pass uh, those mountains. So uh, yeah, we'll see tomorrow. One last hurrah in the mountains tomorrow then, hopefully. Yeah, well, uh, I hope I can recover well and then uh, maybe try to attack or do something tomorrow. Okay, thanks, Freddie. Best of luck tomorrow. Thank you.